man, it is uh, so interesting. Um, I was talking to a buddy today, and he was, you know, he's a sound engineer that travels all over the world when COVID's not happening. And he was uh, he was asking me what I was up to, and, and I just sent him this quick text. I wasn't really thinking about what I was saying in the text um, as far as being like cool information or news, but I sent him a text saying I'm recording for five different people, um, all one song each in five different, they're all from five different states. And I'm just at home in Charlotte and then I'm gonna go home and have dinner with my family and play with my son. And I just, it kind of hit me you know, when you're just busy in the normal grind of life, you're just doing stuff and getting emails and loading songs in and sending stems out. Uh, it was, it kind of hit me and I stopped for a minute and I just, it was one of those kind of thankful moments of like, man, uh, I know so many people that had to go get a job um, and do something that they, they're not passionate about or they don't necessarily have a desire to want to, um, you know, they don't have a desire to want to be like a factory worker or whatever else, but they're doing what they can to make ends meet. And then I was sitting here, you know, tuning up the drums and I'm, it just hit me about uh, kind of that whole feeling of like feeling humbled by what has been presented to you. Um, really when you don't feel like you deserve um, something like that. And uh, yeah, I just, uh, I wanted to uh, show you guys a little bit of what I'm doing when I'm remote tracking for people. Um, you know, I've got uh, this set up with all my own mics and then obviously like there's a laptop in my interface and, um, but uh, it's just been really, really amazing to kind of go down this path of remote tracking when the um, the artist that you're tracking with is just communicating kind of through text or email and they're not in the room with you and you kind of have to just choose a new level of confidence uh in your own plane and in your own decision making um and then be confident to send that off to them uh really kind of almost cold turkey like they haven't had any they didn't hear you kind of hash through your brain ideas and come up with the like the final result they're hearing your final take that you're sending them for the first time and they might not have a clue of what direction you went or they might have been thinking something completely different. Um, thankfully, a lot of the guys that have emailed me and you know hired me to do something for them, they really kind of left it up to me to be creative and to be me. Um, I think I mentioned that in another video, but that kind of uh, can can kind of make you feel a little bit like the pressure's off, but then it also ultimately is really on because then you're forced to feel like you need to try to just be you. Um, and sometimes you feel like you maybe shouldn't try to be you or you're not really being you. But yeah, it's been super fun. Um, super, super fun to be able to do this. And uh, it's weird to say that without COVID, I probably wouldn't have been pushed to start uh, getting a recording set up to where I can remote track. So I'm not thankful for COVID, but I am thankful for what it kind of forced me to do. It kind of forced my hand. Uh, and honestly, I think a lot of what was holding me back was just not feeling quite adequate to offer that stuff to people. Um, and I know we all deal with different insecurities like that, but if I could encourage you guys in any way, uh, don't waste more time waiting to start something that you're passionate about or that you have a desire to do just start get your hands dirty and you'll figure it out as you go you know it took me a lot longer of a an amount of time to set up at first and to kind of get one song done it would take me several hours more just because i was second guessing myself so much um and yeah as i keep doing it it gets smoother i get more confident in what i'm tracking what i'm sending off um so yeah, I just wanna um, just wanted to share that today and let you guys know that it, I'm very thankful and humbled by you guys reaching out to me to do this. And I hope uh, whoever's watching this, you know, hit me up and let's figure out how I can help um, your projects um, mature or however I can be a help. Um, yeah, hit me up. I'd love to be a part of whatever you guys are doing.